I was uh, raised in a Christian family. I always thought that, you know, there's, there's a God, and I devoted myself to him at a very young age. I never really, like, um, knew that he was there with me. I never felt his presence with me. But I, I recently got into a relationship with a girl. We never got really serious. We broke up, and then we um, got back together quite a lot. And, um, you know, we, we fooled around, and. Uh, she got really mad at me and she uh, started talking to this other guy, which made me very uh, jealous. And uh, the guy she was talking to, um, she sent nudes, pictures to, to him. I, you know, kind of moved on and I went to this other girl. My friend uh, made a website that um, he put the pictures of her on the, this website. And uh, he was like, hey, you know, I had putting pictures of girls on this website. Do you have any pictures? I'm like, well, yeah, I have pictures of the, this girl I'm talking to. He's like, okay, then just, just put it up. And I'm like, oh, okay. And so, I mean, I was very um, hesitant at first, but I figured, you know, it was a, it was a blocked website, so um, you could only see it if we let you. You know, we thought, oh, that'd be cool to just, just let all our friends see all these pictures of girls that were nude pictures. And so I figured, you know, nobody's gonna find out and like, I'd be okay. A few weeks later, I got called into my, uh, my school office and um, at the time I was going to a, a Christian school. You know, I, I had a great relationship with all my teachers and with my principal. And um, I got called in and I was kind of worried like, oh, is this what about the pictures and stuff? Because I knew like people were talking about it and uh, they just wanted to know if I knew anything about the page. And, you know, I said I didn't and like, I just knew that the, my friend, he, uh, he made it. But um, I kind of felt very compelled to um, go in the next day and tell my principal that I did put up pictures. And so he was like, you just have to be uh, suspended for uh, the rest of the week until we can, you know, figure out what's, what's going to happen. I honestly, I thought I was not going to get, you know, kicked out or like I'd be okay. But uh, coming back from the spring break, I actually got expelled. At first I didn't believe it, you know, like I thought it wasn't really a big deal. And, my parents, they're very disappointed in what I did. They said, like, you know, you, you've grown up Christian, and, like, how can you do this to this girl and, like, embarrass her and, like, and, like um, defile her like that? And my, uh, my friends, they, you know, I lost a lot of my friends, um, you know, saying, you're a Christian, how could you do that? And, like, you know, I'm going to a Christian school, and, you know, I'm supposed to be a lie to others when I, when I made a bad decision, and I know I'm confessing with it, and, and I mean, I'm turning to God. I never really thought that, you know, I'd be, I'd be where I am now. And God, I get the chance to get, um, to, go, to go back there next year, to go through a discipleship program for 12 weeks with uh, my youth pastor, Brooks. And you know, he's very, uh, uh, he's very dear to me and he, um, he's helped me through a lot.